everyone. I wanted to take a few minutes and talk to you about some of my favorite journals because uh, over the last several months, I've been trying to get more analog because every time I open my phone, it's a distraction machine. And so I've been moving more and more to writing things down with pen and paper. And so my YouTube uh, suggested videos right now are just tons of people talking about their journals. And I was like, why don't I make one talking about my journal experience and some of my favorites? And so today, what I wanna talk to you about, um, I, I have several different ways that I journal. Um, so I have my uh, bullet journal type thing that I do. Uh, and I'll, I'll talk about this sometime, my setup for this. I've modified the bullet journal um, methodology for myself as a pastor, like how the, how it best helps me. Uh, but today what I want to talk to you about is kind of my uh, daily writing journal um, that turns into a, um, a pocket journal that I use for doing stand-up comedy. And for that, I use just a, a generic dot grid journal. Um, and so uh, if you don't know who I am, my name is Jason. I am a, a pastor, but I'm also, uh, I do stand-up comedy for funsies. It's a little hobby. It is not something that I'm like, I'm going to be a stand-up comedian someday. It's just fun to do. And I get to meet a lot of people. And uh, and so one of the things that has been a discipline that I've been building over the last about nine months is taking time to write every day. Write something every day. And uh, some people would call this like morning pages and there's a like write for 25 minutes or three full pages. I don't have that kind of time. And so I write, I try to write 10 minutes a day. And I started in my uh, everyday journal uh, and I was just going through the journal too quickly. So um, I decided to set aside uh, for my own little independent jokes journal. And I, I mark it here on the side, jokes journal. And the day I started this one is November 1st, 2023. And so in this journal, uh, basically every day, I, 10 minutes takes me about 10 minutes to write a day's worth uh, of, of jokes. And it's one page. And most of these, most of these jokes are garbage. They're never going to get out of this journal and onto a stage. But every once in a while, uh, I, it, as I'm processing through my garbage jokes, I do come across something that is, uh, that I want to develop more. And so I'll come back around to it. Like this morning I talked, I was talking about, um, manifestos and how we call them manifestos. And it's usually just one guy who gets really festoed about something. Um, and that's why we call it a manifesto. And I'm like, I don't know if that's funny. It made me chuckle this morning. Uh, and so I, for tomorrow's notes, I actually made a note like, Hey, start with this, come back to that. Um, and so, yeah, so I just kind of write these down, um, every, uh, every, every day. And I, you know, I don't get it every day. I try to do it every day. Um, but I bought this generic Amazon notebook and I'll see if I can find a link and you can get one too, but it's a dot grid. Um, and has a ton of pages and that's why I went with this one. Um, but then what has been great, uh, for me when I do go to an open mic or do a show, um, I, this journal has a little pocket here and inside that pocket is just large enough for one of these noteworks journals. Now people talk about field notes and I have field notes. I I've used field notes, field notes. They're good. They're great. But in my experience, they're actually just a little, they're a little too small for me to, uh, to even write in. Uh, and so compare a field notes to the, the Noteworks journal. Uh, this, is, this is more real estate for me to write in. And so what I will do when I'm going to go to an open mic is I will actually write out the, the jokes that I want to tell for that open mic. I'll just write them all out here. And this is big enough that I can set it down on the stool um, that's usually on, this, on the stage, and I can just look at it without bringing up this massive journal and saying, I'd like to read to you from this thing. Instead, I can just bring this little, little thing up. Now, how did I find Noteworks? 
I went to high school with somebody named Weston, and he posted on Facebook that his company, a print shop in the Seattle area, they were going to start making these little notebooks. And so I was like, oh, I love notebooks. I and I, you know, I want to support my my friends and their businesses. And so I um I I bought some and they I bought six and they come in these excellent let me real quick just grab something. They come in these little cases that are sorry, I have a dog. Uh, they come in these cases that are like VHS cassettes, and you can label the side if you want to save them, uh, and they all just come right into there. And so it's a storage solution as well. Um, but yeah, they're great, and they're also small enough to put in my pocket, my back pocket. And so if I'm doing a show and I don't want to have my notes out on a stage, I, but I want to be able to like review the headlines, the main points of my 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 set then I can just have it in my pocket before I go up and kind of take it out and look at it and like kind of hit the beats of the thing. But this little journal, Field uh, Noteworks, has been a huge help. Um, and so, yeah, so I, I uh, that's kind of my, my joke writing journal process as I, I have a bigger journal for daily writing and then I have this for performance. And uh, that has been a great help for me to be able to uh, use these too. And so writing things down, it, it has been way better than trying, even though I can't search through these things, uh, it has been way more helpful for me to write it down than to try to type it into my phone and then look for it. Um, I don't know, something about the analog method has been really uh, wonderful. And so, yeah, so if you have any questions or uh, any thoughts on this or if you want to, uh, and links on the Noteworks, I'll throw the link down there uh, for these awesome little journals. Um, but yeah, I, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, fears, trepidations, whatever, let me know. And uh, yeah, thanks for taking the time to watch this little video. Uh, in the future, I, I do want to do my, like I said, I'll do my bullet journal modification uh, video for how I use this as a pastor. Um, this has been one of the best things that I have started doing in the last year. Uh, it has changed so much about how I feel about my life by putting it down on paper instead of trying to live with it all in uh, on my phone. So write it down, folks. Write it down. Thank you, everybody. Bye.